Alrighty, alrighty. What's up, guys? How are you doing today, tonight, wherever you guys are? Alright, we got Brian, Naughty, EGS, Just Water. Okay. Let's dive in. Alrighty, episode 5, this is for all the marbles. This is the finale to season 1, yes. And we will pick up season 2, you know, in <clears throat> 2024 or whenever I get my PS5. It's obvious that's why Vicky hates you. Your dad helped bump off her parents. Why would my father have the Veils killed? I never said he killed the Veils. She was born in Arkham. Victoria Arkham. So where are you gonna go? I've got some other business I need to take care of. Oh my god, Bray's here. What did you do? That... That was me getting rid of Lady Arkham's drugs. With the innocent people. I did what I had to do. I had to make the choice about what sacrifices to make. <laughs> oh, you psycho! <laughs> we broke his leg so bad. You can do whatever you want to me. But Lady Arkham's plans are already in motion. And he destroyed Wayne Manor. That's bullshit, bro. Open Penguin's ass is the best part of this game. I mean, you're not wrong. That scene of him turning his head right there would have looked so much cooler if he were Two-Face. Without it, he just looks like a douchebag. How Batman moves so smoothly in the end of the game, I swear. He be moving smoothly. Smooth operator. The city is still reeling from an explosion Mayor Harvey Dent set off that obliterated an entire city block and killed innocents. When questioned about his extreme measures, Mayor Dent said he'll use any force necessary to take down the children of Arkham. I thought it hard was going to like, fuck you. <laughs> Run, Gordon. Oh, they shot him. We'll let you live. Meanwhile, his opponents are routinely silenced. The latest to speak out is Police oh. Commissioner Grogan. He called Dent a murderer and a terrorist and demanded his immediate resignation. In response, Dent's enforcers attempted to arrest Grogan, sparking violence inside the precinct. These are dark days in Gotham. Our mayor promised us a better city, but delivers Illusion only more violence. violence. How well, he didn't become two-faced, but he did become a villain. Stay in power. How oh. long can we... Uh oh hey, excuse me, you can't be in here. Hey, you can't do this! Shut hey, up. let me go! Hey, hey, stop! I'm surprised he didn't up. just shoot him. You should have known better, Gordon. Now we nail your tongue to the precinct door by order of City Hall. Just try me. You punks. Should have sent for Selena. Ooh. Oh, the bat suit got fixed. Damn. 
Just in time, Batman. Ugh. Mayor Dent's lost his goddamn mind. His enforcers have overrun the city. Apparently, our new mayor doesn't care much for dissent. He's ordered a purge of every honest cop we have left. Which isn't many. Dent is a maniac. And he needs to be stopped before he tears this city apart. Yeah, don't let me get in your way. Come on. The commissioner's still down there. Oh. Well, we know he dies because he becomes Commissioner Gordon, so... I don't even know who that is. Noah who? Oh, uh, we know what Bruce looks like. We've played as Bruce a lot. He does not like Vin Diesel. Sure you're up for this? I have to be. Follow my lead. Bro, he straight up murdered that guy. They can't hold out much longer. Oh, I guess my suit's fixed because we took out Penguin, so I got all my gadgets back in a new suit. Damn, niggas is just dying, boy. Smoke grenades. There we go. Oh yeah, brother. Okay, so everything we just did was for nothing. Give his life for he Gotham. A hero, giving his life for Gotham. I'm sorry, Lieutenant. Now this, this is not your fault. It's a bastard, Dents. Krogan was a good man, a family man. Lieutenant Gordon, Gordon, come in. S Sergeant Kelly, report. It's the mayor, at Wayne Manor. He's got hostages. And he's killing them one by one until Bruce Wayne shows. He says, he says, cops show up, he'll kill another. Batman shows up, he'll kill them all. Kelly, get out of Sir, there. Sir, I'm... I'll let the coin decide. Kelly! Kelly! Damn it! Ooh. Get yourself to a hospital, Lieutenant. Uh, so do we go in as Bruce or as Batman? Oh, shit. Going as Bruce. Alfred, are you safe? Yes, I'm barricaded in the Batcave. I heard gunshots, but then Harvey's men disabled the cameras. I have to face Harvey as Bruce Wayne. Otherwise, he'll just keep killing people. Perhaps going as Bruce could be an advantage. Even without the suit, you're a formidable opponent. I'll draw his focus from the hostages. Their lives are the priority. Just remember, your life is important, too. I'll be standing by if you need me. It's time to end this, Harvey. Hey, Once illusions back. All.
He's half demon, half angel. Uh, okay, sure. <laughs> it's your boy, <laughs> skinny penis. <laughs> I want to save for Gotham. Gotham, that, we're working people not the can raise their Venus. families. <laughs> the fear of being robbed or stabbed or, or worse. I just, I know I can make the city better. If only I... Okay, I'll back you. <laughs> Come on, Bruce, that joke is in poor taste. I'm serious, Harvey. I'll fund your campaign completely. I've lived in Gotham my whole life, and I've never seen an official I can believe in. Rip the skinny penis. Tell you. Oh, thank you, Bruce. I, I, I promise I will not let you down. Oh, my headphones about to die. Never even crossed my mind. The only real question is this election or next. We'll let the coin decide. <laughs> Lucky. But someone has to die. Are you volunteering, Deborah? Harvey! Wayne! About damn time! Oh shit. Snipers, two of them. How to properly toss a coin. I'll see what I can do. Uh, can you do the I trick where you make the coin come. go across your fingers? I can do it. I throw you at Arkham. Burn down your home and nothing. Where do you actually grow a backbone? I came to help my friend Harvey. I he don't said, Fuck. want your help. I want you dead. That is the sickness talking, and I know you're in there somewhere, Harvey. <laughs> Wait, what am I saying? I've tried to fight it, Bruce, but I can't. I only ever wanted to help Gotham. And now look at me. To flip the coin across your him. fingers, all you have to do is feel it. You don't have to actually see it. He's stronger than I am. I've known you a long time, Harvey. You are stronger than your demons. I could always count on your friendship, Bruce. Until what happened with Selena. This city needs to be purged of people like you. All of you! Uh -oh. Traitors! <laughs> terrorists! <laughs> cops who don't take their mayor's oh. orders! Why do you pick the Are cop first? This is the only way to clean up this cesspool! He's good. He's good. Oh. Bro. No, please! <laughs> Dude, that was this close. is what happens to people who cross me, Wayne. You were the fiercest DA the city ever had. Someone who fought for people's dreams. So much for a safer Gotham. You're right. This isn't me. Go. Go. Get away. Hey, I, I saved would somebody. Let them all go, but it's not up to me. Oh, that dickhead. Deborah, my not so faithful assistant. You've been feeding my enemies info since the start! <laughs> I swear Back I did. Beg all you want, but it's not up to me. Your life, his life, even my life, they all hinge on chance. <laughs> I didn't do on it. The flip of a silver dollar. Listen to what she's saying, Harvey. Our people will lie through their teeth for a stay of execution. She didn't betray you! Yes, saved another one. Oh, God. What did I do? Hey, could I have saved that cop? What? Did I fuck up what that did dialogue? You make me do? Oh, fuck Ow, yeah. Bruce. Stay back! Oh, God, please don't. Harvey, no more. I'm just getting started. This is the only way to keep people in line. Kill me instead? Otherwise, they walk all over you. 
Harvey, please! You called me here for a reason. Take me! You... you were Harvey's friend, Wayne. He thought you'd save this city together. Uh, but he... He was a fool for believing in you! Oh shit. <laughs> I thought he was gonna impale him in the face at first. That's enough, Harvey. You're... You're right. Oh, well Two-faced well move, I know. But sometimes... You have to make your own luck. One last call. A bullet in the head, or one in the heart. I'm feeling pretty good about those odds. Let's throw a whole bunch of coins up. Oh. Give me the coin. I need, I need the result. Where do I shoot? Drop the damn coin! Without the coin, I can't. I don't know what to do! Throw it or pocket it. Throw it or pocket it. Uh, uh, uh. Chat. Pocket. I don't think so. Bruce. I don't I don't know what to do. I can't decide. That's too much. That's too much. Too much. I can't. <laughs> A safer Gotham, Harvey. Oh, he's crazy. Just like you wanted. Did Illusion change his profile picture? Wherever they put me, whatever they do, I'll get out. I'm coming for you, Wayne. Nowhere is safe. You're gonna die. I'm gonna get you help, Harvey. We will get you better. I am better, Wayne. I'm the best I've ever been. Oh, you'll see. <laughs> I'm not done yet. Okay, he crazy. Hold on. I gotta see if I can... Plug my headphones in without them dying. Alright, well, I can't hear, so hold on. Let me plug them in and try. Alright, now we're good. I can't even see what your profile picture is. I'm assuming it's something Fortnite related. Since it is always. Uh, his profile picture is Tupac, I believe. Mr. Wayne. I, I owe you so much. You're a hero. And I'm gonna make sure all of Gotham knows it. You should be rotting in Arkham! Uh, what? Can you not arrest this guy? You cops are the worst. And he still had a gun on him. Arkham hasn't forgotten you. Everything you love will burn. Worst cops ever, bro. How's this man a clear terrorist? It's just gonna be like, sucks to suck Arkham guy? Yeah. He still had body armor and a pistol on. The fuck? Alright, well, Harvey's gone, Penguin's gone. All we got is Lady Arkham, right? We got this. Easy. 15 minute stream. Done. Your usual tea, and the entire pantry, I'm afraid, didn't survive the fire. This is from my own personal supply. Thanks, Alfred. 
We're not the only ones that took a hit while Mayor Dent was in power. Well, at least you've ensured Harvey won't be hurting anyone else. Bruce, these last few weeks, I worry about the toll they've taken on you. Facing off against Harvey and Oswald in a matter of days. D not just the physical toll. Those were men you once trusted. And after finding out what you did about your father, people must seem a great disappointment to you. Always letting you down. Even I have you, you Alfred. Admire. Not all people. You've never disappointed me, Alfred. But I have. Everything that happened, I could have stopped it if I'd done something all those years ago. I mean, it is this, true. This is my fault. Yeah, you know what? All you suck, it, Alfred. I told you I wanted to leave your father's employ. But if only I had the guts to do something instead. Your mother, she wanted that. Wanted to put an end to his crimes. If I'd helped her, if I'd stopped Thomas, Give Alfred a break. none of these horrors would have occurred. Lady Arkham, Oswald, even Harvey. Whose fault it is doesn't matter, Alfred. What does is that we stop them. And his skin right, is peeling sir. off. Oh, the children God. of Arkham are still out there. <laughs> and Lady Arkham. With both Penguin and Mayor Dent off the board, she's the only remaining piece. We need to figure out her next move. The only thing we do know is that she moved on from her plan to poison the city. With Penguin gone and my CEO access restored, and finally log into Wayne Enterprises and see exactly what Oswald was doing during his time in charge. If I cross-reference that with all the data we have on Vicky Vale, we might be able to figure out the children of Arkham's next move. I mean, Wayne Manor getting burned sucks, but, I mean, we have enough money to rebuild it. And nobody figured out my secret as Batman, so we good. Hey, Billy's here. What's up, girl? Peter Grogan, deceased. Feels bad, dude. Queen Billy. <clears throat> Dozens fear dead. Yikes, bro. Mayor didn't cobble pocket on his ass beat. Your administrative access to Wayne Enterprises should have been reinstated by now, along with your title of CEO. Let's see what Oswald was doing while he sat in my chair. I don't know what Batman's past Master is. Master Cobblepot's sense of humor hasn't changed much since you were boys. Can we just see what he was doing? <laughs> Cobblepot Enterprise. Surveillance real estate financial report. Penguin was tapping into surveillance systems across Gotham. Any building using Wayne Tech security could be spied on from the CEO's office. How is that any different than the back door into the Wayne network that he uncovered? That's not unless. Hold on. Where'd that extra file come from? It just popped up. <laughs> Oswald was, was trying to buy an island. What on earth for? Looks like he was using his new legal control of Carmine Falcone's assets and likeness to brand the place. It's some kind of tourist attraction. 
He was going to call it Falcone Island. Hmm. We need to figure out Lady Arkham's next move. Of course. Falcone Island? What? Oh. Oswald certainly wasn't very. Oh, it's just a pun, like Coney Island. Yachts to return, I guess. It appears. Also explains how the children of Arkham had a seemingly endless supply of guns. Oswald was using Wayne money to arm them. Oswald altered several public records using the Wayne network. Oswald manipulated my records as well. It would appear your degree was in. Sociology? And my medical records. There are some... Well, but... Colorful... Diseases. Uh. Annoying, but not hard to fix. Uh. Oh, <laughs> that's better. Well, no surprise here. Oswald wiped away any trace of his criminal records. His background is completely fabricated. He was enrolled at... Cambridge? Ridiculous. Calm down, Alfred. I'm sure the board realizes by now that they were fooled. Oh, you're not gonna fix that one, though. Oh, Vicky, here we go. All mention of her birth name, Victoria Arkham, is completely gone. Wait, 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 wait. What's this? He also erased something from Vicky's research at the Gazette. I can't tell what was removed from here, but Wayne Tech leaves a trace when it alters data. One the bad computer can decode. What is it Miss Vale wanted to hide? Everything. Wait, was? Oh, I guess there's nothing else I gotta look at there. All right, let's go to security. Can I scroll down? No. What do we have here? They did more than just look at these schematics. Every building in Gotham with the Wayne Tech security system can be accessed from here and remotely controlled. If Oswald was the brawn, Vicky is the brains. So let's check her file. She may have left clues about what she was using Oswald's access for. Was I just there? Uh, hello? Wait, did it glitch out? Can I not go to her file now? Oh, Lady Arkham file. Duh. Vicky Vale, mid 30s, reporter for the Gotham Gazette, and not in the public record. Her true name, Victoria Arkham. To think she was here in the manor. She gave nothing away of her true nature then. All right, shoot her in the head. <laughs> Vicky embraced this identity to follow through on her twisted crusade. Her mask inspires fear, not unlike Batman. I just need to find her. The children of Arkham. Their symbol dates back much farther than their terrorist activity. They formed to get justice for those wronged at Arkham Asylum. But the message fell on deaf ears. Until they found a leader Gotham couldn't ignore. Uh, what's going on? As far as I can gather, Pop and Billy are best friends and they're gonna go shopping later. Am I right, or no? The Gazette's records of the articles written by Vicki Vale. This record isn't complete. You're right. There are notable gaps between entries. But yet, it doesn't seem she ever left the Gazette's employ. So what was she doing in that time? This record wouldn't be easy to alter. Seeing what Oswald was up to could give us a fresh perspective. Now that we know how Oswald manipulated Vicky's records, the back computer should be able to... There. No more holes. She was looking into Arkham patients. Reviewing records, checking submissions, prior histories. She was trying to 
figure out who was actually sick and who was committed because of Hill, Falcone, and my father. Damn. Vicky was digging deep. Gotham City records, freedom of information requests, post to conspiracy forums. All to find. It's a list. Gotham buildings that use Wayne Tech security systems. It's a list of targets. City Hall, Arkham Asylum, GCPD headquarters, Gotham First National. It's almost every landmark in the city. We're on to something. Vicky wants to bypass the security at a Gotham landmark. But without a man inside Wayne Enterprises, she can't unlock that door remotely. She'll have to get her hands dirty. And when she does, we'll find her. Speaking of... Is it Lady Arkham? No, it's... Catwoman? One of Lucius's prototypes. Oh. On the move. What? But Lucius locked everything away. Well, he needed a better lock. <laughs> it is her. She stole from you? After we opened our doors to her. After all that you two... Alfred. She can't be I trusted? No, Bruce, but... Why would she do this? Is she Can't that cold-hearted? That selfish? I was just another mark to her. I should have known. Computer visual. The prototype she stole. It's an electronic skeleton key. With it, you could bypass any security system made by Wayne Tech. That key is far too dangerous in Miss Kyle's hands. Especially with Lady Arkham still at large. Get the car ready, Alfred. And Alfred, let Lucius know what's happened. I'm going to get some answers from Selina. Time to beat up Catwoman again. I see you, bruh. Damn it. Hey, Bruce. I wasn't expecting you. Thought I'd make it outside the city limits, at least. Clearly, my ride needs a tune-up. If you wanted to see me, you could have just called. <laughs> the chase is so much more fun. But I know you're not here for me. Are you? I don't blame you for wanting it back. <laughs> I'm surprised you had a toy like this. No doubt Batman would use it for the good of Gotham, but the less noble options are so much more... exciting. Why should I give it back? I will make you give it back. So much potential. Just imagine what I'd be able to dig my claws into. Enough games, Selena. Hand it over. Now. <sighs> you just have no imagination, do you? Don't make me take it. Catch. Make sure that's the real thing, not a decoy that she made. It's clear you're not gonna be any fun. And I'm not in the mood for a fight. Yeah, you better <laughs> back down. Oh, come oh. on. Don't pretend you're not impressed. As long cons go, this one was a beauty. Getting into Wayne Tech's lab took a lot more than cracking a safe. I had to get close to people. Your friend Harvey. Poor guy just wanted to fall in love so bad. After that, it didn't take very long to get my introduction to his BFF. <laughs> the great Bruce Wayne. Imagine my surprise when the rich playboy turned out to be Batman. Scourge of Gotham. I don't know why she's fronting because the thing that she wanted to steal is in my way. hands and she gave up the pussy. So Batman so wins, wins, you lose? From the moment we met, I knew I couldn't trust you. Like, how is she bragging about and that? Yet, <laughs> you did, or we wouldn't be here right now. But I can see the magic's over. I'm getting out of here while the getting's good. Gotham's a house on fire, and I'm not going to burn with it. If you were smart, You'd get out of here too. I'm this never abandoning Gotham. You. 
Hates your entire family. Just leave it all behind. Do something more... meaningful with those skills of yours. You don't need the money, but... But think of the fun. Gotham needs me. And I won't abandon the people of this city, no matter how they feel about me. After the way they've treated you, you've got one hell of a thick skin. You're gonna need it. It'll be good to put some distance between us. After all, look at what happened to Harvey. It'd only be a matter of time before I crossed one of your lines. Isn't that right? My copy of the Boy Scout Handbook is out of date. I'm bound to break some rule. Harvey was out of control, and he wanted to destroy Gotham, if you did the same. And yes, I put you behind bars in a heartbeat. Hell yeah, he would. Looks like we're back where we started when we first met on that rooftop. Enemies. Are you mad? That's on you, hell yeah. Well, you're not really leaving me with much of a choice. <laughs> oh, please. You weren't even trying to see things from my perspective. You're stuck in your close-minded, one-town world. I need you to understand something. You are just a job. A frustrating, if sometimes entertaining, job. Dude, she's sitting here telling me that she wanted to steal from me the whole time. Like, this whole plan, her even showing up in Gotham, was to get that little thing that she handed over. But she was sitting there bragging about it like she actually did something. And she's like, yeah, everything that I did was to get this thing. It's like... Well, yeah, but it's in my hand now, so why are you bragging? You failed. And Bruce got to smash. So what's up? And that job's done. I'm done with you. It's not complicated. I'm not a good person. I'm certainly no hero, and I don't want to be. All right, I'm a we get thief. it. That's all I am. Are you trying to convince yourself or Bruce? I told you that from the start. I never pretended to be anything else. You're right. You're a thief. And nothing more. Glad we agree. Well, she's so there's mad. One good thing to come out of this. She's so mad. No, I know I was right. You really are just like everyone else. Can't wait to get out of this place. Yeah, she big mad. Stay out of trouble, Selena. Because if not, I will stop you. Hell yeah! Certainly try. Hell yeah! What a response, dude! <laughs> I want to stop you. Fuck yeah, Batman. You tell her. Lucius, I've got the key. Uh, hold on, Alfred's on the line. Hey, Alfred, I... Bruce! Lady Arkham! She's here! I, I tried to keep them out, but... Alfred? Alfred! Bruce is gonna be so lonely. Yeah, but we don't really need Selena being here anymore. You know what I mean? Like, she is a criminal at the end of the day. You can't trust her. <clears throat> she cannot be trusted. Alfred! Dude, did we already refurnish Wayne Manor? Oh, no. Lucius, it's Bruce. He's not here. Damn it. I'm going to search for clues. But Just Selena's tell me hot. How I can help. Bruce Wayne gets Get way hotter ass as than can. Selena. He fucks I'm models. On my way. We're gonna find him, Bruce. I know. You gonna take Alfred? You know you fucked up. Figure out what happened here. What happened to you, Al? Detective Batman is on the case, or Detective Bruce, I guess. A scuff mark. What could have caused this? Ash everywhere. What did they do to you, Alfred? Something big was thrown against this wall. Or someone. Face was knocked over in the struggle. 
The fight left nothing untouched. Except this table. What's that down there? Anything? No. This pool cue was used as a weapon. Swung so hard it broke in half. Blood pattern looks like it came off a high velocity hit. A high velocity hit. Uh, is there anything left? Oh, something over here. Damn, there's, oh, I did see that. Fire poker. The lock's been completely destroyed. Alfred must have barricaded himself in here. But they got in anyway. There's an explosion right here, it looks like. Furniture scattered outwards from a single point. Alright, well, link this scuff mark with... Oh, wait, can I not do that? The furniture? Hello? Scuff mark, look at the shelf. These weren't scattered by the same event. Splashes of blood. Alfred used the pool cue as a weapon. Broke it across his attacker's head. When that didn't stop him, he used the jagged end to stab him, spraying blood across the pool table. In a couple of days, I would have been here for two years. Could have had a platinum. Uh, not exactly, because we just started with uh, memberships. So, at best, you'd be bronze right now. But I get what you're saying. <clears throat> the crazy thing is... If you ever do become a member, um, how many people are going to be ahead of you? As far as a uh, loyalty badge. Alfred grabbed the fireplace poker to fend off an attacker. <laughs> But it was knocked away. He did shit hard as hell. It bounced off him like that. Oh, that's her. Jesus, that's fucking scary. EGS2 stream. Lady Arkham must Hilarious. have used the concussion blast from her staff to try and stop Alfred. I know what happened. The children of Arkham broke in. Alfred barricaded himself inside the parlor. He had just enough time to grab a pool cue as a weapon before Lady Arkham blasted the doors open. He broke it across one of their heads. Then stabbed him to get away. Another assailant tackled Alfred, knocking over the vase. Alfred almost escaped, but then Lady Arkham entered the parlor, used her staff's concussion blast, scattering all the furniture in her path, throwing him against the wall by the fireplace. So Alfred grabs the nearest thing to use as a weapon to defend himself. Lady Arkham deflected Alfred's attack, causing the poker to fly across the room and lodge into the wall. More blood on the mantle. He smashed his face into it. Damn. Wait. That picture doesn't belong there. Imagine if Alfred whooped her ass. 
Lady Arkham wanted me to find this. Big man. Wait, Billy's not friends with who? Bray? Head, Lucius. Worrying isn't going to help Alfred. We need to focus. You're right. Let's get started. Alfred keeps adjusting his glasses. The reflection. He's making sure I see the reflection in his glasses. Hey, Donald, what's up? The bad computer can use multiple reflection angles to recreate the room that he's in. And I can view the virtual image using my cowl. Good thinking, Alfred. Uh, some pretty good tech right there. <laughs> Catwoman, big man, dude. Uh -huh. As after this time, the damage is already done. If and when we meet again, we'll be back to where we started, enemies. Cool. Batman's a lone wolf anyway, until I get the Bat family. Oh, dude, I hope he has the Bat family in the second one. That'd be cool to have Robin tag along. Okay, Lucius. Freeze frame on the first signal Alfred gives. Paint us a picture. Here we go. Oh, look for clues. He's wounded. Must be one of the thugs Alfred fought upstairs. Professional grade camera. Probably came from the Gazette's office. Stairs? What the fuck? Stairs leading up. Cement walls. We're in a basement. Alfred's trying to look at things that might give us a clue to where he's being held. You're gonna get the Skyrim Platinum tonight? Okay. Looks How like far away are you? all there is to see in this frame. Let's move on to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Roger's Plumbing. A service company for the water heater. I can use their records to find home One addresses artifact for the clients. Nice. We're getting closer. Yeah, but we're not there yet. Do you know what artifact you need? I hate it when uh, like doing collectible trophies, and I have no idea which one I'm missing. So you have to like replay and do all of them. <clears throat> Has anyone mentioned you? You are the name of a girl rapper that only talk about her pussy. Uh, she she also has the name Mulatto, yes, but Mulatto really just means um, a person descended from a one black parent, one white person. 
So, but yes, she is also a mulatto. I believe she's a mulatto. That'd be weird if she took the mulatto name, but is not actually mulatto herself. Doesn't seem to be anything else here. Let's keep looking. Nothing else to see here. Moving on. Uh, her actual name is Mulatto. It's just M U L A T T O. Mason stamp. A Mason stamp. Only one Masonic lodge in the city. Gotham City Fraternal Order of Stonemasons. So the house was built in 1945 by them. That's a big lead. Lady Arkham. Keep searching. Jump to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Okay, he's going up there. Oh shit, window. A basement window. What's that outside? Give me a second. They're by a bus stop. There we go. Okay, I think we have enough to pinpoint a location. Well, let's hope. Uh, okay, so let's start with bus stops. We get the bus line from this, but no stop number. This will help pinpoint the neighborhood. Build year. Okay, filtering for all homes built on that date. Holy shit. Thank you, Miss Naughty. Appreciate that. 25 buckaroos. Thank you, ma'am. These are all the homes serviced by this water heater company on the days and months listed. Oh, we're getting close. store seems unlikely you live off of $25 wow okay then bowling alley <sighs> damn it let's keep looking you are not going to believe this what is it lady arkham is back at the Vale house where she killed her foster parents According to its records, it has a basement. Well, just in case she's expecting you. What is that? Something I almost didn't get to finish because of Penguin. Oh, it's a new back It's suit? the most advanced version yet. <laughs> Lady Arkham will have no idea what I've got up these sleeves. The Mark II. Oh, hells yeah. Well done, Lucius. You've been long overdue for an upgrade. This suit is beyond state of the art. This ends tonight. Mark twos and everything. I feel like it's a little too silver for me, though, for my liking. So I like, I'm well, maybe not silver, just shiny. Heading into the basement. Be careful. About to get jumped, dog. Oh, I'm about to get jumped, big homie. Woo! Oh, I should try to shoot. Batman. I'm all right. Why the fuck is there a gun right there? Who put that there? Vicky? There's no one here. No Alfred. Damn it! There's blood on the walls. I'm going to see what I can find. 
Standing by. He looks fucking bigger too. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Alfred, there's a boot print in the blood. Lady Arkham's soldiers dragged him. The trail stops at the wall. Actually, it goes under it. Sounds like there's more to this basement than it would appear. Taking a closer look. The wall is just a facade. Why would the Vales have a false wall in their basement? Now let's find out where the Vales were hiding. There's a small room. With a hole in the floor. And a rope ladder. A rope ladder. Anyone down there would be trapped. Alfred! Oh, it's a trap. Don't jump down there. Can I back out of this? No, I'm stuck here. Great. I'm going inside. That's a long ass drop. Bruce, what's down there? Do you see Alfred? No. It's some kind of torture chamber. Shackles, belts, blood. What? Vicky, she was kept down here, locked away. Who could do that to their child? I'm beginning to understand. What is there to understand? To willfully hurt a child? It's why she killed the Vales. They abused her. I'm not saying what she did was right, but... But I can't imagine what she went through. The Vale's foster children may not have been the only ones to suffer here. I followed Alfred's blood into this hole. If he had any opportunity at all, he would have left me a clue. Bro, does anybody feel bad for Vicky now? The belt. It's caked in blood. scratches, fingernails. Someone tried to climb out. Alfred? No. Alfred lay down here. Shackles. Blood on them. Old. And new. Vicky did to Alfred what was done to her. Disturbing. Vicky created her here, in this room. This is where Vicky Vale became Lady Arkham. There are drawings. Vicky must have drawn them when she was a prisoner. The chalk here is different, newer. One piece apart from the others. Blue. Mm. The same color as my tech. Can't be a coincidence. Maybe. 
Some of the words have been highlighted. She will liberate. Added to an old drawing of Arkham Asylum, he drew figures outside the gates, like they're running away. The words highlighted are, she will, and liberate. She will liberate. She's gonna let people out of Arkham. I don't see what that has to do with Alfred. Alfred's just along for the ride. She's been using Wayne Enterprises to get access to the buildings with Wayne Tech security systems, including Arkham Asylum. She's going to open the doors, release the inmates, and she took Alfred with her. Call Gordon and the GCPD. I'm on it. Lady Arkham won't be expecting us. We'll catch her by surprise. Except there's a camera in there, isn't it? Probably. Dude, imagine Harvey gets out, even though... Uh... We just put him there. Come on out. Bullshit. Arkham Asylum's worse than jail, right? We all agree to that? Everything good? Orderlies are rounded up. That's the last of it, then. The children of Arkham have taken over. That suits no slouch. You're well prepared for a fight. And the GCPD are on their way to deal with the inmates. If you can find Alfred, maybe you can get him out of there before all hell breaks loose. Almost ready. Let her know. Copy. On our way. Both this and a prison would suck, but here you're getting, like, tortured. Probably going through, like, shock therapy and all that kind of stuff. This ends now, Vicky. Oh, he looks Tell cool, me though. where Alfred Pennyworth is. The butler. Bruce Wayne has a bat on his payroll. Answer the question. Where he is doesn't matter. He'll be dead soon. Another corpse in Bruce Wayne's family. No one's dying tonight. You really think you're in control here? <laughs> Your confidence is impressive, but that won't save the butler or the rest of Gotham. The lesson needs to be taught. They won't look the other way. Not again. And when did Gotham look away from you? Don't try to psychoanalyze me, Batman. You have no idea what I've done to come this far. Oh, I got a little bit of an idea. Too much to turn back now. I know you've suffered. You were tortured, held captive by the people who were supposed to love you. I don't know how you survived. You wouldn't know how I survived. I survived. Because every night, I dreamed of the revenge I'd take on them. And this forsaken city. Your time's run out. Oh! Ooh, I bounced back quick that time. Let's see this badass. Vicky! There's nothing you can do, Batman. You underestimate the true children of Arkham. You underestimate my These power. Kept behind bars. Open the doors! Oh, we're fucked. Arkham! Listen to me! 
Freedom is yours! The only one standing in your way is Batman. Batman. He stuck me in here! Me too. There you go. He's the crazy one. Let's do this bat. Oh, I'm about to get overwhelmed real quick. Oh, that thing is awesome. Parkour! Oh, shit. Woo! Security systems offline. Every inmate's loose. The leader of the children of Arkham. Did you see her? They went. But he pointed and Batman was gone. Hero of Gotham. Big facts. Hey, Samson, what's up? Damn! God! They are beating the shit out of them, dude. Like people are about to die in here unless I can has already fractured the orderly's cheek and nose. Nice. Sam the Bam is here. The man, the myth, and the legend. Uh, you and... Build to contain right, this. Slam his ass through that door. Bro, am I gonna have enough time to pull this off? Oh man, it's gonna be badass. Oh, he's gonna throw a table at her. Let's fucking go back. Fuck you. <laughs> Imagine getting kicked that hard. Mm. Yeah, dickhead. Okay, girl. She. That was a good move. Ooh. Get fucked, Vicky. She crazy. Oh, it's Zaz. That's the plan. Come on, Victor. Oh. Truly inspiring. Such a pleasure to see your work in person. Uh oh. Yes, finally they're here. Fucking Joker is insane. We've got the inmates. Fuck it down. Yeah, the Joker is Bruce Wayne's friend. We met him uh, last episode. Montoya. No, I should have saved her earlier. Oh, there's the blue guy. What the fuck is wrong with him? Oh, is he retarded? Him? Why do you think Joker's in Arkham? Who knows? I don't know what crime he did. There's no in there. way out now. What if he just there's went in there willingly? There's another way here, Batman. All the people that Thomas Wayne condemned to this place unwillingly, they speak through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. I can't help those people now, but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. 
take me to him. My pleasure. Whoa. Beat her ass while she monologues. He can't beat her up. He has to find out where Alfred is. He needs her to uh, give up the location. Damn. Well, he was not ready for that fall, huh? Vicky! What are we in the crypt? <laughs> Of Arkham Asylum. <laughs> You're not well, Vicky. You need professional help. <laughs> Says the man dressed as a bat. Are you kidding me? I'm hurt now. Let him go. Oh, that's Butler Alfred's has to die. Dude, she better not kill Payment Alfred, bro. For Thomas he took away my family, so I'll take away his sons. If you really want to save the butler, bring me Bruce Wayne. If anyone can find him, it's you. He's probably cowering behind a 12-inch thick wall and a hundred bodyguards right now. Why should I trust you'll keep your word? Because my mask is off now, Batman. I won't lie. What the fuck does that have to do with any of You're doing so much for one old man. Oh shit! Vicky, stop playing games. This isn't a game to me. You know, Batman, I really don't understand. Why are you fighting me? I've done great things for Gotham. Falcone and Hill deserved to die. If anything, I did you a favor. No, they deserve to be. We're fighting the same fight, Batman. Can you see that? We want the same things. Those men deserved their day in court, just like everyone else. So they could have gotten off like they did so many times before? No, Batman. They got exactly what they deserved. My justice is final and absolute. You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be defending him. You think Bruce Wayne is in Night, Naughty. Thanks for the donation. He hides behind his status and wealth. He's a coward. Blaming other men. How the hell did she get so far away from me? Oh, there she is. I'm curious, Batman. I know why I wear the mask. It's who I am. Who I was always meant to be. What about you? I was rude to you. Do you wear the mask to hide? How dare. Or to become who you really are? Are you the man? Or the mask? The mask is a symbol. The mask is a symbol. Some fear it, but for others, it brings hope. When I first saw it, I found it inspiring. And once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. He's gonna bring this whole facility down. Dude. Chase her, battering, something. Oh, wow. Alfred. Hold on, Alfred. You, you. You came, you came for me. Uh, after what you said, I knew you'd come. The man, the man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. 
Did you see where she went? Uh, she just... Dis disappeared. I'm getting you out of here. Above you! <laughs> Interesting how you speak to him. So familiar. Alfred? <sighs> Such concern. For someone you've never met before. It's called compassion, Vicky. Something you seem to know very little about. Sounds like deflection to me. There's more here than you're telling. It makes me wonder. Do you really care? Only one way to find out. Oh, oh. that man. Don't you? Shut up, old man. You've seen my true self. Your turn. Prove that you can. Take off your mask. <clears throat> oh shit. Let me see the man you really are. Do we take off it? Do we take it off? Ah. Okay, take off. If that's what it will take to save him. No! But now she knows my secret. She knows who I am. Oh, Bruce. This must be some kind of trick. Bruce Wayne, he, he'd never be the man Batman is. He only looks out for himself. Oh, but of course. <laughs> now I understand. As Batman, you can prey upon the weak, the defenseless, just like your father did. A true way. <laughs> There's nothing heroic about you. Stop blaming other people for your problems. You are the only one who suffered. You really think you can preach to me? You? Of all people? Enough! Oh! What the fuck? <laughs> No karate. Like, I was trained by the League of Assassins. I should be able to beat her ass. Let's go, Bruce. Take her boots off, please. Fast. There we go, slow back down. Ooh. Damn. Holy shit. 
He punched the fuck out of her! <laughs> Where is Alfred? Is he dead? Lost. Forgotten. Buried. And Gotham will not mourn. The sins of the Wayne bloodline end here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Please pick Alfred up before he gets crushed. She's still alive, dog. I see your true face. I'll never trust you. Bro, we gotta go get her. We gotta go get her, bro. Okay, well, never mind. <laughs> never mind. She's very much dead. Uh, can we run, please? Can you not carry him? Okay, chat. So the rule of movies is that unless you see a body, they're not dead. But... She's dead, right? Like, she's As definitely dead. As to last dead. week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as uh, the Batman. excuse me, vigilante? Her death marks the end <laughs> of Arkham's reign of terror. I have never heard it called the vigilante. If the public knew the half of it, it's better that they don't. Any Dude, word from Miss Kyle? Bruce has a I chunk of his ear missing. Anytime soon. With everything that's been going on, I... I Dude, Bruce looks so gross. To thank you for what you did. Sacrificing your identity for my safety. But uh, it was a dangerous thing to do. You could lose everything. The secrecy you've worked so hard to maintain. Gone. Without you, none of this would work. You are my family. You don't know how good it is to hear you say that. After everything that's happened. And your ear? At least there's something left of it. <laughs> Dr. Tompkins assured me it adds character. <laughs> that it does. Dude, if she comes back in season two and like tells everybody my identity, I'm so pissed. We will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. You should be proud. I didn't take them down alone. I had help. You, Lucius, Gordon. That girl for sure did. Come Selena, on now. I hope so. And all those who gave their life fighting for Gotham. To those who helped, and those we lost. I mean, as you said, I hit her like full the power with that staff. Children of Arkham it should have broke her back. Gotham a city in turmoil. And she was just, she was all good. The at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen. But experts agree that... Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you plan to do for his future. Well, this could be a first start. For you, and for this city. 
Though, in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm <clears throat> proud of and honored to call my friend. Aww. Thank you, Alfred. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well, Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. A soul for a soul. I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly what Gotham needs the most. Perhaps one is truly the mask. And one is who you truly believe you are. I feel like I need to go as Bruce. I need to clear my name. I can, like, put money behind the city. And Batman's been, like, killing it the whole season. Nobody's pissed at Batman. Like, they're always going to be on Batman's side. But I think this is a good opportunity to jump back in front of things and be Bruce. And maybe that'll help me out for next season. You know? Instead of them still hating Bruce. Everyone likes Batman, not Bruce. It's true. But like I'm saying, like me doing this thing is not going to help Batman any because he's people already love him. But they hate Bruce, so this could be like a chance to like swing it the other way as Bruce. <laughs> so Bryce. <laughs> Yo, imagine Bruce is like, <laughs> I'm, I got this Alfred. <laughs> I'm going to go. <laughs> I'm going to go as Bryce. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh good shit. <laughs> Let Gordon know Bruce Wayne will be there. You'll make quite the impression. Gordon will be grateful. Ooh. Now if I show up and everybody's just pissed at Bruce and like this doesn't help me in any way, I might be upset. Just a tad bit. I'm like, no 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 no. Bruce was the other guy. I am Bryce. See? The missing ear chunk? Bryce, Bryce Wayne, long lost cousin. <laughs> Gordon, no, Bryce will be there. Commissioner Gordon. Oh, man. Commissioner Gordon. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't sound right. <laughs> Commissioner Gordon does sound right. It will. Thank you for having me, Commissioner. What uh, happened to your ear? It looks painful. Cut myself shaving. Are you fucking serious? What'd you serious? use? A chainsaw? <laughs> Cut to myself be honest, shaving. I was surprised to get your call. Now, after that nasty business at your manor, I know Harvey was a good friend of yours. A loss like that, I wouldn't blame you for lying low. What you did is no secret. These people all saw there's more to Bruce Wayne than just the playboy. Public opinion is bound to swing around. Before long, you'll be Gotham's golden boy again. These people, they have no idea who Bruce Wayne really is. Time to show them Bryce. That's about to change. <clears throat> oh yeah, oh. I did save those well, people. I look forward to knowing the real Bruce Wayne as well. I saved those hostages as Bruce Wayne I was Wayne there hoping there. Batman might show up too. I wouldn't mind knowing he was keeping an eye on things here. Not to mention, <laughs> he makes one hell of an impression on people. So, does this mean you trust the Batman? Uh, to play by my rules? No. But to fight for this city? Hell yes. They're ready for you, Commissioner. Now, during times like these, it can feel impossible to hold on to hope. But I have hope. 
Hope that together we can rebuild what was lost. Now in the last few weeks, as much violence and terror as I've seen, I've also seen the citizens of this community band together to fight those threats. And one of those people is Bruce Wayne. Thank you, Commissioner Gordon. Tough act to follow. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm here today to not only show my support for our acting commissioner, but also for this city. Many of you have suffered terrible losses. And some of those losses came at the hands of my own father, or at least as a result of his actions. Come to apologize, that sounds better. I would like to take this opportunity to apologize. To tell you how us. sorry I am for the I'll pain the Wayne family the the caused this community. If my recent incident with Harvey Dent has shown me anything, it's that I can no longer sit on the sidelines. My family's wealth was built on the suffering of others. I think it's time to repay that debt. I plan to use my resources to improve the city and make the lives of its citizens better. And to that end, stronger Gotham Police, a better Arkham Asylum. Uh, stronger police or better Arkham? I am ceasing construction on the Wayne Mental Health Facility. Instead, I'll be devoting all my resources to improving the existing Arkham Asylum. Yeah, they'll like that. The most they'll advanced like mental health treatment facility in the country, in keeping with the vision of its founders. God. How the hell did he not run over anybody in that Clear crowd? That dude sucks. Get that bastard to lock up. Completely overshadowed what I just said, man. Well, I feel like a better police force would just make them be like, oh, he's militarizing the police. You know, like, we have that problem in real life now. Whereas, like, making Arkham Asylum an actual mental health place just instead of, like, a prison for ago, crazy people. Bruce Wayne delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. He sure does come up well. See you soon, Bruce. <laughs> so it's gonna be Joker versus Bruce and Batman versus Joker in the next season? That's gonna be crazy. I don't think I've ever seen where Joker really knew who Batman was. I mean, he doesn't know who he is, but he's gonna be messing with Bruce. Pocketed Harvey's coin. <clears throat> Did you blame Alfred for his involvement with Thomas Wayne? It didn't matter who was at fault. All that matters is fixing the problem. Sixty-seven percent of people said Alfred wasn't the problem. I mean, he was—he was definitely part of the problem, though. He—he uh, he enabled it. He definitely enabled it. Don't, don't give him a pass like that. <laughs> 8 7%. <laughs> oh, man, dude. See, people were just blinded by the pussy, though. That's all that was. I see through the lies of the Jedi, all right? She was bullshitting. She was talking big shit to me. And I called her on it. I'm like, bro, if you really want to be with me, you ain't gonna just talk shit in my face like that. I'm gonna talk back, all right? And you got mad and stormed off. That's on you. And that's exactly what Bruce said. He said, that's on you. Bryce ain't no simp. <laughs> I 
You and 73.1% of players removed your cow and revealed your identity to Vicky. Look at Vicky's face. Shocked. I wonder what happens in that 26.9%. I guess that you probably keep your ear intact. Because you, uh, you have your helmet on so it doesn't hurt you. But I bet Alfred gets fucked up. She probably like blows his head off or something. Do you attend as Bruce or Batman? A lot of people showed up as Bryce. I think going as Bryce was the uh, the correct thing to do there. <laughs> Eight point seven percent. That's funny. Batman season overview. Your Batman slash Bruce was collaborative. <clears throat> Defending Gotham is more than any single person should take upon themselves. It often requires a team of close friends and associates to be a powerful force for good. Uh, how am I reading this? Oh, I was 82% collaborative, not self-reliant. I was 76 merciful, 64% cunning, so I lied a lot. 75% compassionate. Only 9% rejected. Yeah, that's bullshit, though. Like, they're going off information where they're like, oh, yeah, like, either we fucked her or, like, I know that she's, like, an anti-hero from the comics. But Bruce doesn't fucking know that. And, like, she just admitted openly to his face that she was playing him the whole time. So it was just like, alright, well, bye. We did it, bro. Fucking did it. Start of season two. I'm gonna get season two on the PS5 whenever I can. I'm not gonna get it on PS4. I think it'll be more optimized because that like fading in and out shit like really pissed me off. Yeah, well that was Batman Season 1, everybody. Season 2 will be sometime in the future. I don't know exactly when, but... He said no! Don't end the stream now. Alright, here's what we'll do. I could end the stream now, and then start up a, a DVD stream. Separately, if you guys want. I'll just play a DVD for a little bit. Yes, do that. Okay. Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream, and then I'll get set up for DVD. See you in a bit.